What's up guys, welcome, welcome to this video, welcome to this new segment. What I'm gonna be calling this segment is Pops Projects. The reason I'm calling it that is because the name is exactly what it's gonna be. It's gonna be side projects that my dad has going on and it's gonna be mainly woodworking because that's where he's really a professional. My grandfather did that in Germany and blah, 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 family history boring. So anyways, today what he's going to be working on is some barn doors for the inside of a house. They're extremely popular right now. The only problem is they cost about $500 and that's at the lower end. You cannot get one to your house for less than $500 if it's going to be anything of quality. So he told me he has a $400 budget and the quality is going to be just as good as any of the top quality ones. I guarantee it. So let's see what happens. Welcome to the new segment, Pops Projects. So at this point, we got the frame completely done. We're ready to go. It's about three feet by eight feet. That's just what the opening is. Maybe it's an inch more or so on each side in each direction. So with doing the frame, as you saw, he did all the pocket holes and those are all going to be covered up by the 45 degree slats. And those are going to be all nice. He's going to run those through the router to get the edge of the 45 degree boards. They're going to have a 45 degree edge on them itself. You'll see all that. So here we go. So if you're a little confused at this point in the video, I wanted to bring you up to speed. So what he did first of all is he laid out his frame. He used his framing square to make sure that I was all perfectly straight, perpendicular, parallel, all those geometry words that we loved when we were in school. I don't think so, but that's what he did. So once the frame was completely square, he then laid out his diagonal slats of wood. The slats of wood are laid in at a 45 degree angle. That way, when he's actually cutting the edges of them, he doesn't have to completely just freehand it. He could then use his speed square to make sure that he has the 45 degree angle on one side, 45 degree angle at the other, and that makes it extremely easy. That's why he decided to do all the boards at a 45 degree angle, and that's why most builders do stuff at 45, 90, zero, all that good stuff. So once the diagonal slats are laid in there and they're good to go, and he's done with all the woodworking completely with the edge and all that stuff, then we move on to paint. He did two coats of primer. He started off with the brush and he got in the crack real nice, you know what I'm saying? And then he did the roller to get out any brush marks. Once he's done with the primer, he then goes on to the green, which is gonna be the last color we have some accent walls in the house that are also green he has some of this paint laying around that's the color it's going to be it's going to go great inside the house so now the only thing left to do is to put on the hardware and hang it for the final time So 
this is the conclusion of the interior barn door build. If you had any questions about the process along the way, please leave that in the comment section and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up because Pops is out here always putting in quality work and his stuff always looks better than the top quality stuff and he always spends less than the low quality stuff. So that's what you should strive for whenever you're building anything. So while you're here, while you're looking at my channel, while you're looking at this video, make sure you go check out some of my other stuff. I just put up the 1965 Mustang Coupe build part one, plenty more parts to come. I'm going to have more stuff coming up with Pops projects, even though that's going to be few and far between because he's always helping me out with my stuff. So he's behind the scenes doing stuff like that. So thanks so much for watching. Like this video, comment, subscribe, share. You know what it is, YouTube. I'm out.